okay, I I'm going to be honest with you all right now. I was not expecting an announcement like this. As you can see, the headline reads, Orange Time Traveling Manga Gets Anime Sequel Film Written by Creator. I, I don't know what to think of this. It's going to be, from Sua's point of view, obviously... They haven't, that's not in the manga at all, like the story being told from Sue's point of view. So this is going to be all new content in, in a film. Man, I, I'm, I'm happy because it's from Sue's point of view and it's best boy Sua. But I was just, I wasn't expecting something like this. I still have to watch the episode. I have to do it right after I make this video, actually. Uh, but the last episode is like 38 minutes long. Crunchyroll cut out the interviews with the cast of the characters and all that. They'll probably like upload it separately or something. Because I, I would like to see that and, and see what they have to say about the show and, and how it was like uh, being these characters. But we're going to get into this article real quick. And it, it's something. It really is. I'm not going to watch the trailer because they showed at the end of the episode. Um, but you all can watch it. I will have it linked down below. November 18th. The film retells story from Sua's view, then continues the story. Oh my gosh. I, I don't know. I don't know how this is going to be. At least it's from the creator. It's from the original creator. The final episode of the Orange Television anime series ended on Monday with the teaser trailer that announced that a theatrical anime film has been green lit. The title of the film is Orange Mirai, or Orange Future. The film will play for a limited two-week engagement throughout Japan starting on November 18th. And there's the trailer right there that they show at the end of the last episode. And then there's the text and all that there. Like the upcoming two-chapter manga that Takano launching, is launching in October, the movie retells the story from Sua's point of view. It will also tell the story after the manga and the television anime, and therefore not told anywhere until now. So this is all new freaking content of Orge, and I'm just like reading it as I read along. It's, oh, I get, I'm getting so freaking excited and so happy. More content of Orange, more original content from the creator. That is great. That is great. The television's anime cast is returning along with the staff with Naomi Nakayama as chief director. Um, the theme song Mirai. Look at that visual. Look at that visual right there. Oh my gosh. The tagline of the film as seen on the visual above reads, Since that day, I've always wanted to show those two this future. The Anime Now website posted a translation of Takano's comments. The visual shows Kakuru and Naho on a bench as Suwa watches over them. At the Oh, man. Oh, that is great. And that just gives all the details on Orange and all that. But damn, I did not see this coming at all. And I'm just so freaking excited right now. It's so happy. At first when I was reading, I was like, eh, I don't know. I don't know. But as I read along through this article and, and, and learned more about this, because this is my first time reading it, damn, I'm excited. I am so excited. It just makes me feel some type of way that, that we're getting more Orange content. And it's not over. It is not over, which is awesome. Because I've read all the manga and I just thought that was it, honestly. But there's more. And I don't mind that one bit. So, yeah. Um, I'm going to be interested to see how they do it, though. Uh, it's from Sua's point of view. Best Boy Sua. So I think it'll be great. And I'm definitely really excited. Um, but, yeah. I need to go watch this episode. This last episode of Orange. And let me know what you all think of this news. Big, big news for me as a huge Orange fan. I don't know about you all. But this is crazy. This is crazy awesome. And I can't wait. So, yeah, that about does it. Uh, I hope you all enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Peace out.